All right, let's talk about a gratitude challenge here. This is a new challenge that I want to issue. Um, I love giving challenges. These are really cool, and I want you to try it out. Um, this correlates with a section of the 3x5 goal cards that I use in my goal setting program, which is uh, right here. You've got the cards on the backs of the cards. There's a little section at the bottom where you can write the things you are thankful for. Um, it's your, just three things. At the end of every day, you should write things you are thankful for. Hopefully, as you're doing that every so often or regularly, people's names show up on that list because we should be thankful for people, not just things. More than anything, I think, people are the ones that make the biggest impact in our lives. So be thankful for mentors or coaches or teachers or parents or aunts, uncles, cousins, neighbors, friends, relatives, you name it, who have done something for your life. Okay, I want to take it one step further with this challenge. So great for writing it down and putting it on your card and being thankful every day. It's a habit that this system will ingrain in you to start looking for things to be thankful for. It's a beautiful part of the 3x5 goal setting program. But this challenge in particular, okay, this challenge is is just a, taking it one step further and it's just a really small thing. But I want you to um, take one of those people that you, whose names you write down and give them uh, an out of the blue contact, out of the blue, un, um, what is it called? You don't have any intention of getting anything in return for them, from them. It's pure, out of the blue, sincere gratitude and compliment in the form of an email, in the form of a phone call, or a, th a handwritten thank you note. And do at least one every single day, every single day try it for 30 days. That's the challenge. 30 days, 30 sincere compliments without expecting anything in return. And yeah, it might be somebody that you really admire. It might be somebody that you've not even met yet that you just want to send something to. But, and it might be, you know, it could even just be a mom or a dad. Maybe, you know, maybe I don't say thank you enough to my mom, so I'm going to use her for this day. Or I'm going to talk to my, my wife or my husband or, or whatever. It can be anyone. Just get in the habit of giving out and sending out goodness and thankful vibes to those around you. And I think you'll notice a couple of things happen. First of all, you'll start branding yourself as a grateful person. And I think that might be the biggest benefit. You'll start sending out to people that don't know you or that do know you or that um, have yet to meet you are that you are a grateful person. Nobody likes to work with someone that's not grateful, that's prideful and rude and stubborn. And Everyone loves to be around people who are just so glad for things and so happy that you're there and make you feel special and important. And that's the habits you're developing by thanking someone every single day. All right, number two though, this is powerful. You are going to matter in their life for that day. Okay, all of a sudden, you're going to show up on their radar. You'll be like, what? I haven't talked to this guy in months. And all of a sudden, out of the blue, he's just calling me. He's not asking for anything. Just say, you know, the other day, the way that you, you know, I've always admired this in you. I just wanted to call because I was thinking about you. And I just wanted to say hi and tell you that, gosh, I think you're such a great person. And you have these qualities. And I love this about you. And I just hope you have a great day. And that's it. Thanks. Who does that? If you do that, I mean, can you imagine somebody doing that to you? You'd be thinking about them all day. You'd be like, well, what, what was that? You know, who, who is this person? You would be impressed. I mean, way to leave a mark on somebody. It's just calling them and thanking them for being who they are and for maybe something in specific that they've done to impact your life. Okay? Third thing, though, that it will do is it's going to change their life. You never know who's having a bad day. You never know who's struggling with something. Or these people sometimes that we think are, we put them on a pedestal because we see their lives from the outside. And really, if we cross the fence and get on the inside, they are struggling with a lot of things and we have just, we just have no idea. We think that they've got the whole world in their hand and they've got everything going for them and yet uh, they could really use a compliment. So you thank them and you never know the impact you're going to have on someone's life in terms of changing their, their life for good. At least for a day, or at least a phone call. You, know, you can really change somebody's whole day just with a single 
simple compliment. It, it's a beautiful thing. So there's three major huge benefits that you get out of just thanking someone. So um, there's the challenge. Thank somebody with a sincere, heartfelt compliment once a day for 30 days. I'm issuing that challenge to you now, and I want you to try it in 30 days. I want you to come back and either go on my uh, website and contact me or uh, go down below and comment in the comments below and let me know what happened. And I'm dying to see. So try this out, the thankful challenge, and, uh, and comment, let me know what happened.